Hey cuties! So today I'm going to be doing a Boxing Day sales haul. If you're not sure what Boxing Day is, it is the day after Christmas and there are ridiculous sales. I love Boxing Day shopping. I literally wait all year just to go Boxing Day shopping. In my opinion, it's like the Canadian version of the American Black Friday. We do have Black Friday in Canada, but it's much bigger in the States. Our Boxing Day, like everything is on sale. So I bought a ton of stuff because it's just such good deals. And I'm gonna start with Bath and Body Works, which I think I got the best deals at most of their candles there was just like one shelf that wasn't 50% off but all the candles were 50% off so I got six different candles I don't think I've ever had these little jars of candles so six dollars each are super good so that's the 50% off price the first one that I got is one of my favorites and a huge popular one this year it's marshmallow marshmallow fireside Oh, this smells so good. It's a beautiful marshmallow candle. I love these little jars here. You could reuse the jars after as well. So I think this one I will be burning. Next, snow day, which looks like this. And pretty much every day in my city, it's a snow day. And the scent of this, I wasn't expecting it from the name snow day. It smells so fresh and just vibrant. I wonder if it says what's in here. No, it doesn't, but there's a cute little snowman building picture there and oh, this one just smells so yum. And then I got two of these smaller candles. These were $6 each as well. Nutmeg of Spice number one. Oh, this one. Oh my goodness. This just smells like amazing cookies. Oh, this almost smells like gingerbread cookies, but oh my goodness, this is so, and the candles are so beautiful. It's a great size for $6, come on. And this one is in Spice. The reason why I got this one is because it reminded me a lot of my all-time favorite candle of the moment, which is Tis the Season, which I'm halfway through burning. It's really, really similar. I shouldn't say really similar. It does have a little, this one is a bit more fruity and this one's a bit more cinnamony, but they are almost similar to me, so that's why I got Spice. I got a big candle. This one is in Vanilla Firewood, which my boyfriend actually picked out because he loved the scent of it and when I smelled it, I fell in love as well. It literally smells like vanilla firewood. Like literally, like exactly that. So I am super excited for this. The last candle I got was the only one that was not on sale. Raspberry peach macaroon. I hope I said that right. Some people say macaron, but um, I don't know how, that's how I say macaroon, so whatevs. Um, but it's a beautiful like pinky peach color. This one smells so, so sweet. Um, so I just couldn't pass it up because they were having such a good sale on everything else. I thought I could just pick up one regular price one. It wouldn't be no worries. So then I decided to try one of the, something I've never tried before at Bath, Bath and Body Works. My words are all jumbled. But these are room sprays and there are three of them. These are originally $7 each, but they were on sale for three for five. Cinnamon and clove buds, cinnamon frosting, and twisted peppermint. These, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna keep them in my bathroom because they're great for spraying if you have some business going on. The last thing I got at Bath & Body Works were these mini little sanitizers because their sanitizers were 75% off. So they were like 30 cents or something like that. 35 cents, that's how much these were. So the ones that I got, Christmas cookie, iced gingerbread, and melting marshmallow. Nextly, I went to Sephora and I was really excited because Sephora doesn't really have that good of deals ever. Like whenever there's a sale on, it's really not that good. But this time they did have great sales. At the very front when you first walked in, there was a $12 shelf. So everything on that shelf was $12. So I got two things on there. The first one was this little pack of two Buxom products. I've never tried anything by Buxom. The first thing in here was an eyeshadow brush, which the deal pays for itself right here because these are kind of expensive. So the eyeshadow brush comes in its own little case here. It says Buxom right there. And then the brush is gorgeous. It looks like this it's just a basic eyeshadow brush it's very very soft it says buxom as well so I was really happy about that and as well for $12 this is a buxom stay there eyeshadow in the shade poodle I'm really excited for this 
I love gold shadow. So that, and I'll give you a little swatch right here. One little swipe and then right there. It's nice and like shimmery and metallic so it's perfect for your inner corners. That's why I got this. The next $12 item that I got was a little Stila lip pack. So there's just three um, lip glosses in here. They're all nude and they're just perfect to just put over your lipsticks and I love Stila lip glosses. So it looks like that. Or you can use these on your on your own as well. The last thing that I got at Sephora was this big Urban Decay Oco Loco 2. There are a bunch of these 24-7 glide on eye pencils, which I love. I have one only and it's beautiful. I love using it on my lower lash line. It gives you a little pop of color. These were um, originally $68, but they were on sale for $30. That's why I got these. It was an amazing deal there. And this was the last one. People were going crazy for these. So there's tons of different eye pencils in here, which is great because each of these are $22. So I literally paid for one and a half of these. So I'm really, really excited for my sales at Sephora. Next, I went to Claire's. Their Christmas stuff was 75% off. So I got this Happy Holidays flavored lip balms. There are a bunch in there. They're nice holiday little ones. I love lip balms. So um, this was originally $12, but I got it for $3. So that's an amazing deal. And then I got a little Hello Kitty one here. And this was originally $4. So I got it for like $1.10 or something. That is awesome. So I can put this on my Hello Kitty collection. Justin Bieber bracelets. These were not on sale. Justin Bieber stuff was buy one, get one 50% off, but I didn't see anything else I liked there. But these are so pretty to stack. They say really cute things because I am a believer and they're actually really pretty to stack. That's why I got them. And then I got Claire's 10 for 10. So I got 10 items for $10, which are a dollar each. So I'll show you guys what I got. Wing earrings bronzy um, sideways cross bracelet. These hoops are awesome because they have like little heart charms right there. So it just like dangles down. I thought those were pretty. Then I got this set. There's actually three bracelets in one for $1 and they are like gold and pink and they have little angel wings and angels hanging off of there. Got a head wrap. This is just a gold chain, which is awesome. I can't wait to wear this. I've never seen anything like that. Next, I got a phone charm. This goes right into your phone and it's so beautiful like a dollar for this. I could not pass that up Pretty pretty ring right like that beautiful pink. I'm in love Minnie Mouse um, Double finger ring like that. It just says Minnie with a bow looks like this this head wrap here It's a neon leopard. I wore this in a few vlogmases if you're following me on vlogmas Which is on my vlog channel down below and then the last thing that I got was this head wrap here and it sort of like cinches in right there so you can wear it as so. I'm really excited about these. I went to MAC, the only place that was not on sale. No sales there, but I still went there anyway because I really wanted this. Naked lip liner. I have one or two lip liners from MAC. I love them, but I don't have a nude. They're only like pinks and brights. It's just a basic nude. I'm not going to swatch it because it'll just blend in with my hand. But um, it looks like that. And then I got a lip gloss from one of their new collections. I don't remember what it was. It was like nude metallic nude something i didn't like the lipsticks that much they were a little bit too dark for me but the lip glass looks like this and i'm wearing it today on my lips over top of myth it's sort of like metallic a bit so i think that was called the nude metallic collection nextly is urban planet this is such a good deal every shirt that i got here was three dollars so my total because i got three shirts was nine bucks so the first one is this. It says My Little Pony. It's a little tiny crop top, which will be perfect for just lazing around the house. I'm going to go run some errands or just to sleep in. So these are beautiful $3. The next one that I got was this adorable one that looks like this. It's a little pug with a heart and a hat. So this is beautiful. $3. I was just like, oh my god. The last thing at Urban Planet was this um, sunflower sweatshirt type thing, $3. I keep saying that, but OMG. Looks like that. It reminds me a lot of Marc Jacobs' Daisy. So that's another reason why I got it. It has a hood. It's really thin, but it'll be perfect. Sirens. When I went to Sirens, nothing was over $20. I got two blazers. Um, I always get a blazer on Boxing Day just because they are kind of expensive just on their own, but when they're on sale, super cheap. So this first one is just like a royal blue color. When you roll up the sleeves, you can see the pinstripes. $15. This one um, is not like this one because this one is more of a, I don't know, like a, I don't know how 
to explain the material, but this one's more like a cloth, warmer material like this. And this one is so pretty. I got two of the same shirts because they were only $5 each. There was no small left in this one, so I got a medium. These I love wearing with high-waisted skirts. Literally, it's my favorite thing ever. So I got this one here with the bow. And then I got the exact same one, but size small and black in this one. Right, like that. More of these little short crop top things. This one is black, but it has little tassels hanging off of it right there. A lot of people were Instagramming this on um, Instagram on Boxing Day, and I was like, oh my god, I got that too. And it's this little fun. They had all different types of colors of these, like royal blue, silver, gold, but I loved the pink one, especially if I want to layer it with my blazer. It'll look beautiful. Two more of these crappy tops. This one is a bow, and it is beautiful pinstripe there and then this one is feels like a bathing suit but it is not obviously it's just so so soft looks like that i love polka dots another blazer jacket type thing is this one here with the gold chains here loving this i have this shirt but in white and i love it so it looks like this this was only like 20 bucks and i'm in love with I keep saying that to everything, but I really am. The last, yes, the last thing from Sirens that I got was this top here. This was on the $5 sale rack. It's a high-low effect. It reminds me of the movie Signs. Like, it looks like alien, alien -y and I don't know, like galaxy type and nebula, whatever it is, but it's so pretty. The last place in my haul is Foot Locker. So the first thing that I got was this toque here. A Nets toque. It's really actually pretty and I should wear it today because it would match my outfit But um, my boyfriend bought a hat and then it was buy one get one 50% off and you couldn't find another one So I got this one for 50% off. So it was only like $15, which was good two pairs of sneakers I don't know which ones these ones are, but they are both on sale for $54 and they're originally $120 So I got an amazing deal there both Adidas the first ones here, oh my god, they really remind me of JB shoes, but I really like them. I have so many things I can wear with these. They look like a that, and the back says Adidas. I love this little strap here on the back. Like, every time I see that, I'm like, those are the best shoes ever. So, they look like that. I haven't had new sneakers for a really, really long time when I used to be a little G-Unit kid, but um, ugh, these look like that. They're perfect, they're beautiful, they're everything that I love. The next pair that look like this, these were so pretty. Ugh, you guys know that I love pink and blue, so these ones are like a bright fuchsia pink with white, and then this thing right here with blue. I just thought, like, I got two for the price of one, so I just was really excited for that. Love. And of course they didn't really have my size, but with like sneakers like this, you have a lot of room. You don't need them to fit snug. And I like them to be big anyway, so that's perfect. So that was everything that I got for my entire Boxing Day haul trip and everything like that. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye guys.